Hi everyone. Dr. Billy Ralph is under investigation by the Medical Council of Ireland as a result of views he has expressed regarding COVID-19 and its treatment since March of 2020. You might ask what crime has given rise to this investigation? Well, the answer is simple. Billy refused to accept that the science was settled regarding COVID-19 and its treatments and continued to ask questions both publicly and privately within the medical community. Prior to March of 2020, science progressed, indeed flourished through rigorous debate and the attempt at establishing the validity of a hypothesis through peer review and the process of falsification. This entire discipline relies wholly on innovation and independent thought to make valuable and life-saving discoveries. Unfortunately, due to extreme levels of censorship and coercion, few doctors were prepared to suffer the wrath of the Medical Council, the media and the government. However, Dr. Billy Ralph chose to stand tall and publicly express his desire to pursue other beneficial treatments for the sick by engaging in curiosity and argumentation. Many of you may not be aware that Billy's practice grew considerably between the years 2020 to 2022, when approximately 1,000 extra patients applied to join his practice. Make no mistake that many of those patients sought Billy out, not only for treatment, but to escape the demonization and constant badgering they were persistently subjected to by other medical professionals to take the experimental injection. If anything, the Medical Council should be investigating those doctors who pursued dogma instead of science and who valued financial gain over the interests of their patients. The purpose of this video is to ask you to write to the Medical Council to express your disdain and deep disappointment towards this investigation. And with this in mind, we have drafted a template letter that you can use or adapt. You will find this template letter at the link below or in the description box to this video. To make this campaign as effective as possible, we are asking that you please post the letter to the Medical Council as opposed to emailing it. We are also asking that you send a copy of the letter by email to the Irish Times, RTE, your local TDs and anyone else you feel should be aware of this investigation. Many of the doctors who spoke out over the past two years have come under severe pressure to be silent and have suffered great reputational damage as a result of their refusal. They are the men and women who risked their license, their livelihoods, and in many cases their health, to treat those of us who were rejected by our own doctors. Will you now stand with them in their time of need? Thanks for listening.